Roll. This is Therese Semlin. Uh, she's working on a paper weaving. And she may say a few things. <laughs> or she might not. <laughs> <laughs> so I kind of am using the same, one of the same kind of design features of a loom. So this little piece that I put in is the equivalent of the race on a floor loom. And that makes it easier to get things in and out of there. So let's see, I think I decided on this piece. So the weft just gets threaded through. I think I have to go in there like so. And then I use the ruler to just cut as a beater to beat the, I don't, beat it because it's delicate paper, but to kind of push, gently push the paper up into place. And I'm sure the same, it goes across the same way on both sides, so it's square and symmetrical. Out, and pull this out, and I'm ready to start on the next one. So I see the computer there. How is the computer mm -hmm. helping you? The computer is what I use for uh, running the needle through to get the pattern. So I've got the warp is the gray, sky blue, and beige. And then the weft, which is the horizontal pieces, the horizontal strips are um, the purple, the olive green, this kind of sage green, and uh, off-white, so that I can tell the warp and the weft apart when I'm threading it. So as I'm gonna start to thread now, I want the two, four, six, and eight to be on top of the needle. So I'm gonna run the needle through. I've got my ruler here that's um, labeled with the numbers of the warp threads. So I'm going to just pick up two, four, six, and eight. And I'll come back here and see I want 10. And then I'm going to go under 12, 13, and 14. So I'm going to pick up 10 and then go under 12, 13, 14. And I'm kind of double checking my work, making sure that I've got things in the right order before I move on and then 16, 19, 20. So that's how I'm using the, um, the image. And then when I'm through with this one, you can see that I've got this set up in layers so that to do the next one, I can just move my numbers down so that I can keep going so that I don't get, I don't get confused. Uh -huh. So that's what the computer's for. Wow. And that's my process.